What do you think of Andy saying that the Mets are making up ground for the race for Yamamoto? I never thought that they lost ground, hmm. guys. I, I kind of always had them as the one of the favorites here. I mean, they need an ace pitcher. Steve Cohen has long said that he wants to go out. He wants to improve this team. And we know he's not going to get outbid. So, to me, hearing that they were underdogs was a little bit surprising. It doesn't surprise me that they're among this group of finalists. I think that it's going to come down to three teams here. It's going to come down to the two New York teams and the Los Angeles Dodgers. And everyone else is going to be on the outside looking in this guy is a star he wants to win these seem to be the franchises that can best equip him to do that I think he's going to be a guy that wants to look for that so to me the Mets underdogs not in the Steve Cohen era not at all not buying it I think it speaks volumes though when you consider the brand that the New York Yankees have the brand that the Los Angeles Dodgers have they just went out and brought in Shohei Otani that the Mets have kind of positioned themselves to be in that front runner category. Now, it obviously helps when you have Steve Cohen's money. Steve Cohen's money kind of can do a lot of things that other teams don't have an answer for. But I think the idea that you see Cohen and you see David Stearns say, hey, we want you. We're going to go to Japan. We're going to go the extra mile to show what we're trying to build and what we're about. I think that's a really good sign. No matter what happens here for the Mets, it shows you your general manager, your owner, they're on the same page, and they're in it to win it. Nobody's going to question where the Dodgers and Yankees stack up as far as prestige when it comes to the New York Mets. That's what Steve Cohen is going to try to build here with the Mets moving forward. Unfortunately, he can't do that in three, four years or just in an offseason here. What he can do, however, is offer Yamamoto the most money, which I think he will. What he can do is also offer Yamamoto the ability to be the guy here here he will not be the guy on the Yankees with Garrett Cole Aaron Judge Juan Soto he certainly will not be the guy on the Dodgers with endless stars already mainly Shohei Otani Yamamoto can be the guy for the New York Mets and I felt good about the Mets chances to land him anyway but after reading Andy's column I feel even better that the Mets are going to end up with Yamamoto